Before this video starts on Lunar Skies, I got a huge giveaway. I'm going to be giving away a super donator ticket to the first winner. Second winner is going to get themselves a Raids 1 box. And the third winner is going to get themselves a Fubes box. And yeah, guys, all you got to do to enter is like this video, comment your IGN, be subscribed to my channel, turn on your post notifications, guys, and make sure you join Lunars with the link down below. And yeah, guys, other than that, I really, really hope you enjoy this one. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video on Lunars. And today, yeah, we're going to be doing something very different. I haven't really checked out Lunars' whole enchanting uh, steal on the the server so we're actually going to be checking that out today guys and yeah on lunars you can actually get rarities of certain items and i wanted to check the bonuses on them and possibly go do some like just go test it out on some npcs and see if it actually does make a difference so yeah if you guys don't know like there's common blow pipes there's uncommon there's rare like all that stuff so yeah we're actually going to be upgrading a few really good items so taking a look at our bank guys we're going to be enchanting a lot of these items and we're actually going to be comparing the stats now whenever you actually do enchant an item it's not always going to be a good enchant so for example if i enchant like a crossy sword let's just say you can get two different enchantments you can get an enchantment that actually makes the crossy sword worse and you can also get a uh, enchantment that actually makes it a lot better so let's actually grab a bunch of different items guys and let's actually head over to the area that we need to go so i believe this is the, these are the things i got the glistening tears and we're actually going to go and enchant some so let's go do this right now so yeah it also does hover over it says these are unique so let's actually just grab a bunch of random items and let's actually head over and see if we can enchant them to be something better so all right nice we got a bunch of items and now let's actually head over to the area so i believe you just press on the world map and i was told you got to go to some like well area so yeah it is just going to be west of home if you are interested in doing this so for example if i went in pvm then i got an extra pair of dragon claws i would just drop them into the well and you'd get yourself some glistening tears and then with those tears you can actually go ahead and buy yourself an enchantment so let's actually go right here let's climb the wall hello young warrior if you would like to better your gear me and my members might help you with that yes please perfect all right let's actually do this okay cool so this is our little item imbuing system so let's actually drop this in there and let's actually break it down so it says you will get forty-eight thousand glistening tears which is pretty good so uh we can actually check that out with all these different items so let's actually take these out uh this one you cannot enchant this item the only well enchant okay so we'll our armor weapon so if you broke down an ellie guys you would get yourself 200k breakdown points crossy sword you can't really do uh, you can actually go through one by one the breakdown is 1.3 mil of a grazi rapier like that is insane so yeah so we're gonna actually enchant all of these and hopefully we can actually get something good i might actually end up enchanting the grazi not enchanting breaking it down because you get yourself 1.3 mil breakdown so i think that is pretty freaking cool so let's actually go ahead guys and break let's just enchant something let's let's enchant let's start off by enchanting the elijah so boom let's enchant 300k glistening tears yes i am sure all right good news i have enchanted okay so it looks like it enchanted into a better item so if you want to go see the bonuses just uh, hold on your control and over here are the bonuses of the item so it says right here we got plus two stab and plus three range so yeah let's actually keep going let's actually enchant a few more items and see what else we can get all right let's actually go ahead and drop in the grazi rapier oh we can't even we can't even afford that man uh can we drop in a divine oh we can but it costs 4.5 million yeah, because the divine is op as it is so yeah this only costs 119k we kind of do need some points but i'm actually gonna break down the grazi rapier and boom yes i'm sure we got 1.5 mil so now we can actually go ahead and just enchant literally all of our stuff so let's actually do it uh enchant only fresh items maybe oh this oh we already we just enchanted this oh so this was a lot better nice look at look how good this one was guys look how good that is all right let's actually go ahead and drop in the virtus robe top so yeah these pretty much all of these items with the enchantments you can't really enchant if that makes any sense so i do want to enchant some dragon claws boom and let's see what we're going to get here. And good news, I have enchanted your item. Uh, okay, so the uh, enchantment, it actually made it plus 3 stab, plus 2 slash, plus 5 slash, minus 2 slash on defense bonus. And it gave me plus 2 strength bonus. So it is completely random. Like, I could get, like, minus 10 in all of these. It is possible. So, yeah, this is how the enchanting works on here, guys. I can't really enchant any of these other items. But uh, this one, you can't enchant either because it's already been enchanted. So, yeah, these are, like, the uniques, guys. This is, like, the best one you can get. So on my Elijah, unfortunately, 
unfortunately i did end up getting the uncommon but like all of these items these are all uniques and just look at the bonuses guys like plus 10 magic plus 5 magic but you know like it's it's really really good so yeah we're actually going to be testing out some of these items let's actually go put on this ancestral we might go and get some max hits if we can and yeah i kind of wanted to keep enchanting until i get a unique i might do that actually as well so it turns out you can actually enchant the blowpipe as well so let's actually go ahead and drop that in here as well uh because you needed scales in it apparently so if you guys are looking to do this with the blowpipe you guys do need to put some scales so let's actually do it here and enchant it only costs uh, 30k to enchant and i am sure let's see what we're gonna get we got another common man unfortunately oh my god see this is exactly guys this is a perfect example man it just minus six range bonus and minus four range strength so this blowpipe is literally like trash now so what you would probably do with a blowpipe that's like bad um you could, i'm pretty sure can you actually just dump it back in and sell it back yeah so you could like break it down it's probably what i'm gonna i'm gonna do that right now Let's just break it down yeah we don't even need that because that is trash dude imagine enchant i just enchanted and got something worse like that is terrible so we're actually going to be testing out our gear guys on the sponsor snake that they have on this server so we're actually going to be examining it and we can actually take a look at their rare loot so uncommon we can get some decent stuff uncommon is not too bad but then it starts getting really good at the very rare so you can get the sponsor set the scythe sharpener which actually makes your scythe like better and there's the lunar guardian as well so yeah and whenever you actually press on it, it actually opens up this nice little interface so yeah let's actually go and head and kill this sponsor snake so let's see if these hits are a lot better than all right so starting off with a 34 and we weren't even praying like anything good so uh yeah these this gear does seem a lot better i was using regular ancestral earlier and the hits weren't as good on this so the sponsors uh, against a sponsor snake it shouldn't be hitting too like hard but it is doing really really well uh we are hitting pretty decent on it so we're just hitting cost like 20 pluses yeah like 24 right there another 20 is going to come right now so yeah, the gear by uh, itself is really, really good. I mean, it is the best gear you can get. So, uh, if you guys just look at this, I'm getting 10 plus attack bonus, plus 5 on this. So, it is like random stats. So, it could be super, super... Oh, 37, there it is. So, it could be like... a. This could have been a common if I enchanted, and it would have been like minus 5 slash, for example, you know? So, it is like random, and it is pretty good. So, if you do have some items that you do not even want... And you just want to like throw them out just go to the well guys enchant it and make sure you guys enchant the if you're en be enchanting the blowpipe make sure you have scales inside so let's see if we get anything good from this sponsor snake good luck to us let's actually see this is the sponsor snake was actually even on the old lunars as well so sharks we got 44 sharks which isn't terrible i think those are like a k each or something so yeah let's actually kill one more i want to see if uh it's still as good but yeah this is pretty much the best gear i guess you could upgrade the saying stuff i don't know if you could actually upgrade this i'm not too sure uh the lijin you it's upgraded but it's not the best i mean it has minus one slash on defense but that's not that big of a deal uh yeah and i tried enchanting the boots and stuff they didn't work so i believe it's only like weapons and armor that you can enchant all right guys let's do this we got another kill of the sponsor snake let's see what we're gonna get 22 magic logs not the best we're just hitting like the common uh common drop tables unfortunately by the way i've never really said this in the video but if you do end up donating on the server the donator tab is like on the bottom right so this is like your panel so you can like upgrade your rank you could get a storage pet you know there's like a bunch of stuff you can do but yeah, you could actually go to the donator zone down over here now one thing i want to do guys is i want to test this gear now this is actually going to be the um the gear and by the way uh you can actually do some different types of bosses around the world so like if you use this portal by the way you can actually head over to the top donator champion uh which is over here but there's a, but there's someone there i don't really want to crash him so we're gonna actually be testing it out on this guy right over here uh and oh my god we don't even have a super combat hold on all right so let's actually take a look at this uh this setup right over here we, we, we are using a zami spear because i kind of 42 holy shit Wow, but yeah, we're actually kind of using a Zami Sphere because we ended up enchanting our, not enchanting, we ended up cashing in our, uh, what's it called, the Grazi, so probably shouldn't have done that, but it's okay, this thing still looks like it's, look at that, 42, it is just getting the job done, man, I just killed a Lunar's Warrior in like 10 seconds, so this thing is actually super good, we're actually gonna be wait till it respawns one more time so I can show you guys the drop rate table, so 
this is actually the drop table of the Lunaris Warrior. So it does drop the double XP ring, which is huge, man. That, that dude, if you, get, if you get that ring, you are set. You are literally set. And I also get a ring of coins, but that is kind of uh, useless, unfortunately. So, yeah, we're going to get another kill of this, guys. See how fast it is. Uh, this spear is actually super good. I thought it was going to be slow, but that's actually really, really good. Uh, so, yeah, uh, I don't know why. Oh, my God. I think it's actually really good. Oh no, it hit a zero. But yeah, a 35. Dude, this, these specs are good. These are some good specs. Oh my god, I died. Oh my, I wasn't praying. I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> I was not paying attention. Let's go get our sh <laughs> I literally just died. Oh my goodness. Well, yeah, our shit's all over there, so it's fine. All right, well, another Lunarist Warrior down, guys. Unfortunately, we didn't even be able to. We have to go repair our Torva in a sec. But yeah, that was the loot. We got 16k, not the best. So, yeah, but if you do get that, uh, if you do hit that table, man, if you get that double XP ring, that'd be huge on your account. But all right, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. So, yeah, this was more of like an informative video on like a feature that Lunarist has. I don't think anyone's showed this off. So, I decided to hop on and show it. It is a pretty cool system. Them. and yeah it, it, it's like a way of dumping items out of the eco and it's a way to like dump items that you don't want out of the eco so it's actually a really good balance and yeah it is fun to enchant as well like you can get unlucky but at the same time you can get super lucky and get like a unique and yeah i'm pretty sure selling a unique is like worth way more than just selling a regular one so i think that's pretty cool as well but yeah guys other than that if you guys want to join the giveaway there's going to be three winners on this video so first winner is going to get themselves a super donator ticket second is a raids one box third is a fubes box and all you got to do to enter is like this video comment your ign be subscribed to my channel turn on your post notifications guys and make sure you join lunars with the link down below and yeah guys let's actually go pick the winner from our last video so the winner is going to be on the screen right now so congratulations to you bro make sure to pay me game to get your winning other than that guys make sure you join lunars with the link down below and i'll see you guys in the next one